Oh, there we are. We start the show with a little bit of They Might Be Giants and then, of course, the Fountains of Wayne with Stacey's mum, who I see every day because my next-door neighbour is Stacey. The morning after show with me, Selfie, and I can tell you it's time for us to look at those football results that happened in the weekend yesterday. And, of course, what a great weekend it has been for Oxford United because they've had a great weekend away at Derby. They won 2-1. And then they went to Barnsley, a place I don't think we've ever won before in a long time. One three one. Brannigan penalty, a Williams own goal and Tyler Goodrum with the third it was a good weekend for Oxford City as well they travelled to FC Halifax and picked up their first point of their campaign with an equaliser from Fonku and I tell you what, Mark Jones at Banbury thought life might have been tough to start with but two wins in a week from there, they beat I can tell you they beat Gloucester in a week and then they won yesterday 1-0 at home with Otabayi getting the goal against Chester. Into the Southern League Premier Division we'll be hearing from Jamie Heapy very shortly as well but they lost an 8-goal thriller 5-3 at uh, Tiverton Town right with two goals there and Smith with the third for them. In the Southern League Division 1 Central just the one game and we'll be hearing from Mark Massingham later on in the show as well. The Kidlin to Manicus they picked up their first point at a difficult place to go and play Hartford Town they won. They drew 1-1. Richard getting the goal there as well. In the FA Cup preliminary game, North Lee's hopes of going through have been extinguished by Bishops. Cleve Goss got the goal in a 2-1 defeat at home. So there's plenty of games going on. There's plenty of football going on. We need to hear all about it. And there is a brand new app made by me. Just go onto my Twitter and get the link to see Oxfordshire Sport all in one place. It makes it easy for you, absolutely easy for you. Just if you want, just direct message me. Go on to OXSO or Oxford underscore sports on Twitter and there's a link to find a new app for your telephone. It makes it so easy to find local sport.